Oh, hot dog hat. Oh, hot dog hat. Hot dog hat. I made up a song, guys. Anyways, what's up, everybody? Hope you guys are all having a great day. Let's go ahead and get started with today's FTB. Okay, guys. Today we are on episode 17. And once again, we find ourselves out of power because we ran out of Yellorium again. Uh, so annoying. So annoying. But it's all right because today we're going to fix that problem indefinitely by running a humongous... Humonga, it's not, you can't even pronounce it right because it's so big. Humongous, anyway. So, episode 17 today, guys. Hope you guys are all doing good. Uh, let's go ahead and do a couple things really fast. Geminator challenge for today is going to be 418. No, that's a little low. Let's do 463 likes. I don't know why 463, but I'm going with it. Don't ask questions. All right, question of the day. You guys know I've been doing some good questions of the day, so you better be ready. Oh, yes. When you were a kid, what was your favorite cartoon? That's right. Favorite cartoon? Go. That's right. I want to know. Favorite cartoon of mine when I, was a, when I was a youngster, when I was a little guy, was Rocket Power on Nickelodeon. That, Doug, you know, you gotta love some Doug. Hey Arnold, all good ones. All good ones. So, what are we doing today? Well, we're out of power, so we need to give um, our uh, reactor some power. And so what we're going to do is we're going to power the reactors, and then we are going to pattern some stuff. We're going to pattern um, deep storage units, and that way we can have all of our stuff, because we're, we're going to be running a really, like, the quarry is going to be like a zillion by a zillion, probably. I'm just saying. It's going to be a big guy. So we need to run, um, we need to make sure that we have all the storage possible for this guy. And so let's see here. I'm going to put 32 in there and see where that puts us. Okay, so that, that takes full of that. All right, good deal. So we'll get two Cory or two of those guys running. So we do have a little bit of time here. Uh, we should have enough power to look into the system. Perfect. All right, so what do we need for some deep storage? I like the deep storage. Uh, resonant energy cell frame, plastic sheets. Uh, well, first off, how many deep storage units do we need? Technically speaking, we could get away with four. So let's try and craft the... It actually makes four. Perfect. So let's go ahead and get this thing patterned here. Do I have any plastic? I, do, I need patterns. I need patterns ASAPular. Um, so yeah, that's another pattern thing that looks like I lost when uh, we moved. It looks like I lost the base pattern for it. Uh, so... Uh, here, I've got, I guess I gotta craft it over here first then, don't I? You... And I don't have any glass. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get some glass. I'm going to get all that pattern, and we're going to make some deep storage. As soon as I have that deep storage done, I'll be back in a GIF. All right, so before we actually install these deep storage units, let's check and see how Hypno has his set up. So I know for a fact that his deep storage unit is right here. So I'm looking at his cable setup here. All right, so he's got... A storage bus going into an interface and then the cable wraps around it all right and then on top of his deep storage unit he has just a single interface I can break through the wall here just to show you that if you look right there he's just got a single interface okay so now that we know how to do this it better work man it better work I've had in the few in the, in the past I've had nothing but trouble with this stuff so um, so storage bus interface cable wrapped around. All right, so let's go back to the base and give this a shot and see if we can get this to work. I actually crafted, um, like four of those. I don't know what happened to the other one. Gems. You know, when I, when I think of the name gems, it reminds me of American pie. Uh, when they're in the bedroom, the bounce go wow wow scene, you know? <laughs> and she's like gems she's all excited that's what it, that's what it reminds me of i know i'm dumb uh okay so let's give this a shot let's see what we can do i might have to pick another level or something for this to work i think i might come off of uh something up here because in here i'm not sure that we're gonna have enough space to do this the right way um all right where should i put it i think i'll put it like right here maybe or maybe like right here all right so i'm gonna bring a cable off of that and then we're going to do um 
not that way. I want to do it the other way. Thank you very much. So, cable storage bus interface cable wrapped around. Okay. And then deep storage with a storage bus on top. Now, this might be a little off because it is connecting to the system in a couple different places here. Like right there. Might need to raise this up into the air one. Uh, okay. Cobblestone. Cobblestone. Anything? Hello. And I saw that they have this set to a thousand priority. Nothing. Nothing at all. I don't know if he has uh, cobblestone set in this thing as well. Let me steal that. Cobblestone. 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 Dude. Alright, I will try it one more time, but I will try it... Um, with this not touching the system, because I feel like that's probably the issue. So let's uh, cancel all these settings out. Let's pick all this up. Yeah, I just feel like that's the problem, is with, that it's touching. There we go, because his was completely, like, off the grid, pretty much. Okay, so I will go here. Um, storage bus interface cable cable i don't think that matters right there we might need to go up well you know what let me do this off the middle because the middle won't touch anything i don't want it to touch anything i want it to be exactly like hypno so i know that i'm doing it exactly right i probably dropped like okay maybe nothing all right let's try this one more time so cable um, deep storage interface and uh, so then we need to wrap the cable around that so this is how he had his just uh, a little different looking and then I'll do deep stores right next to that and uh, storage bus cable uh, priority of a thousand and then cobblestone cobblestone I I don't know I don't know why it's not working and then just to make sure that I'm doing this right cobblestone cobblestone nothing yet the only thing I can think of would be to set this to a thousand. I have no idea. Yeah, it's not storing anything. What the hell? This is exactly how he has it set up. The only thing I can think of would be to look at this interface setup that he has just to make sure that there is uh, no cards or anything there. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm just exploring Hypno's base here. Uh, trying to figure out what I did wrong, and I've noticed that when he comes off Dent's cable, he oh, he's got um, these P2P networks here. So I'm going to try that. I think uh, that's the only thing I could think that it would be any different. And he's got it anytime it comes off. Looks like most of his system here. So I'm gonna head back to our base and I'll try that real fast. Okay, so I've cleared everything out of the way. We're gonna redo this and hopefully get this right because. I am getting very annoyed. So Hypno had a P2P network coming off his dense cable. So then it goes up to a couple blocks, just like so. Um, then we had a, uh, let me get these in the inventory slots here. We had a, a storage bus, right? Storage bus, then an interface, and then the cable wrapped around it just like so. There we go. And then he went up a block and this is where he had his deep storage unit right there and then we'll put a storage bus on that put that there 
and let's make sure that this is all empty 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 and so let's try it with cobblestone so all he had set up for his was uh cobblestone there and cobblestone there and it should be storing and it's not i have no idea why it's not working i cannot figure it out and then even go a little bit further i checked the details of the priority and it was 1000 still nothing there and just to be safe i'll actually even put um cobblestone like configuring these to cobblestone is it not gonna do well, whatever config cobblestone uh cobblestone so that like it's all configured to cobblestone now and it is just not doing anything this is exactly how he has it set up i have no idea why it's not working but i'm not going to waste any more time with this day we're going to move on and do other stuff stupid deep storage okay guys so since our deep storage is not working we're gonna have to result to, to a secondary plan here i'm going to delete these items <laughs> you're probably thinking like why would you delete anything jevin well to be honest with you um it's just like stuff we don't use cobblestone and gravel things like that so uh when it comes down to it it's you know it's pretty much useless for us to do that so uh, just a temporary setup here. We're going to do export buses. Um, we need seven of these to show. How many is that? Four? Uh, actually, there's only six sides. Okay, so apparently I forgot how to math, but it's all good. Uh, we might need to grab another trash can real fast. Grab another one. There we go. Yeah, so um, I'm just going to delete these because it seems like it would probably be the easiest thing to do to be honest with you there we go so let's run some cable between all this really quickly you 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 just why not let's just run cable between all of it you you there we go all right so that's all hooked up so let's just go ahead make sure I would assume everything is working. I really have no idea. Let me see if that's putting into the system. Do, 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 do. That is incredibly slow. All right, so it's going to need a speed card. Uh, I'll probably just do one speed card per, just to make sure. All right, so cobblestone, gravel dirt and so this is going to clear up a ton of space for us doria this should pretty much make all of our drives actually uh empty well not empty but they'll be for the most part you know doing good there there i know you're probably thinking like wow you're wasting a lot of material but in the end we'll be getting it back like tenfold with the because the size of the quarry that i'm gonna make is uh it's gonna be a pretty big guy so hopefully that's all of them all right let's go check moving pretty fast moving pretty fast okay yeah it's working and then these guys should start clearing up pretty fast as well perfect all right, so I've got to set up a new quarry. So what I've done, I've already went ahead and did a couple things here. We have uh, some books in here that I want to grab. We have two uh, books. I'm going to link one book to right here. There we go. And let me grab, do I have any lecterns? No, I'll have to make some. Let's make two lecterns real fast. Lectern. There we go and um the other one will go to the quarry so we'll put a light turn down probably just right here for that all right so i've got to go to the quarry and move it and get everything set up uh, i'm gonna fly pretty far away for that so uh, it's gonna take me a little while once i have it set up i will show you the size that i decided to go with and it took me longer to set the boundary for this thing than it did to actually set it up because it's oh good lord um there we go 
So our boundaries are 2400 by negative 2200. This thing is uh, 2000 by 2000. I figured that would be sort of a good starting point. Put that down. Let's do some power. Uh, receiving energy. Um, I think might be something might be wrong in our base actually, because it's not it's saying zero blocks scanned, even though we have energy coming in. Anyways, let's do this. Let me take this guy, mark this spot, and then we'll put this book back, go to the Void Age. And do I have a Tesseract? Maybe that's why it's not working. Maybe I don't have a Tesseract put down. Uh, nothing there. Yeah, I think that's the problem. Okay. We'll get one of those placed really quickly and get that, that quarry some power. Okay, and I'm gonna go up a level. Well, at least that thing will probably be running for quite a long time, I would imagine. Uh, so we'll go there. Uh, Ijevin, and we want to. Items blocked, fluid blocked, and receive or send uh, only uh, for that. There we go. Sending energy, so technically speaking. There we go. That's got power, but that cobblestone shouldn't even be going into the system. Yeah, it's all voiding out. So how is our drives doing? Ooh, look at that green, baby! Hoo-hoo! Looking good! That's awesome. So we've got a giant quarry set up. Uh, hopefully we get some power going soon because... Uh, do I have any yellow orium? Or do I have any... Um... Uh, uranium? No. That's not good. Let's go check on those guys really quickly, actually. Hopefully we get some in the system soon. So this guy's losing power. This guy's both losing power. So hopefully we get that set up in the system soon enough to where this guy will start processing the stuff that we need. Awesome. All right, well, hopefully that quarry will go and uh, we'll continue on. All right, let's move on. All right, guys, so it's been a little bit of time. The quarry has been running. I think we're actually doing good because some of these have more um, <clears throat> RF than others. It looks like, yeah, it looks like we're actually getting fuel in a lot of those. Let's go ahead and check out our ore situation in the system. Okay, yeah, we're moving right along here. I uh, took the the pulverizer inside that had the yellow orium, and I took the one up there, and I filled both of those up. So all the ores should be processing all of this stuff. I'm gonna figure out what I want to do with this stuff because we have a lot of this stuff. What does this actually do? So you make turbine housings with that turbine rotor, turbine blade. So it's a bunch of turbine stuff. So you can make a giant turbine with this. It looks like. Plus, it makes a cool looking block. What does the dust do? Dust just turns into yellow or, or the blue stuff still. Okay, I don't see. I guess it turns into two if you wanted to make two of it. But yeah. Um, I'm a little confused at some stuff with our system though. Even though we have... Um, hold on, let me find it. Even though we have a good setup going. Like say like this, uh, this reinforced strong box. Say I put it over here. And then I go into my system, reinforced, you see how it's not there? I don't know why it's doing that. Um, now these all have, well, hold on, let me look at this. You see? Okay, I'm actually starting to notice something a little bit different here. You see how these are all super bright in color? Let me grab that strong box from here. Make sure nothing is in any of these, and I'm gonna t I'm gonna try it in this one. Now let me see. Okay, so it's there now. Reinforced strong box, strong box. Okay, I think it has something to do with this color being completely turned off. Let's go down there and see what the problem is. So I wonder. Oh yeah, that one's touching purple. What's this one touching? Purple. It's got to be something to do. It must... I wonder why it's doing that. 
I don't know. These are all dense cables. Dense cables. I wonder if I just remove a cable or something, if it'll help it. I'm a little confused. No, it's still not getting power. So, the channels come this way. The two channels that way. Neither of the side channels, it looks like, are getting anything... I'm confused. I don't know. I just figured that it would have worked. I don't know why that one's not getting any power. Uh, what about the two channels over here? Are these ones getting channels? These ones have one blue line going to each of them, but this one over here doesn't have anything. I guess that one would be full. I don't see how it can be full, though. That's what confuses me the most. Uh, maybe it's the setup right here that's messing it up. Because this is how we're touching the system. We're just going straight up from here. I wonder, do we, I wonder if we have any dense cable left over. We have 12 dense cable. I wonder if um, just giving it more spots to connect to would help it any. Maybe something like that. Did that do anything? That one still not powered. I don't see it. I need to learn more about AE. I'm gonna have to like read up on this or something because I just don't get it. Still no lines running that way. Now I know it picks like the target path. So maybe if what if we remove like the corner piece here? I'm just not sure if it would be. I don't think it's connected to the system now though. Try something a little bit different here. Yeah, this whole the whole channel system confuses my brain. Uh, you, you, you. Now, does that make any bit of difference? Okay, so the channels are on. That one's getting channels. This one, nope, still not powered. What about this one? That one's power. Yeah, I, I have no idea, guys. I really do not know. I can't figure it out. Huh, that's weird. I don't understand why that works like that. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys all enjoyed and continue to watch the series as much as I like recording it. Uh, if you did enjoy it, make sure you hit that like button, as always, to show the support to make sure that I know you want to see more. Uh, so remember, the more feedback, the better. So I hope you guys all have a great day. And uh, yeah, this is Ijevin. Peace out.